got another instructor audition today. Very curious to see how this is. But anyways, I gotta head to the studio. Running just a tad bit behind as usual. Turns out there's actually a crap ton of stuff that I needed to get done before I go to Canada this weekend. So I've been here for like three hours doing paperwork and getting everything in order. The audition went really well, it was really cool. I'm really interested to see what people think of it. I thought it was pretty cool. Next, I gotta get home and get to work on this video because I gotta get it done before I leave and I still gotta get an oil change and some lunch at some point. Very busy day today. I needed a quick, simple lunch today so I put a steak in the oven. I'm assuming it's gonna taste good. I don't know why it wouldn't taste good, but um, take a look at this. Mm. A little bit tough. If you're watching, Brendan, we were out of gas in the grill, so I apologize. It's 5.22, I just finished the video. Now it's time to head to the studio. This has been a extremely busy day. I think this is like the third shot I've shot for the whole vlog. But, sometimes days are like that. About a year ago, when we first started Adventure Archives, after the first episode, these guys who had a podcast called The Devil's Bench contacted us and asked if we wanted to be on the podcast and do an interview. We said yes, we talked to them, and then kind of found out that we were um, a couple peas in a pod. Anyways, we kept talking to them, we became friends, and we had them on our podcast one time, and we've always been saying we should do some sort of collaboration. That's not what I'm doing this weekend, but I'm just going up there to hang out with them. Uh, they're based out of Canada. You should check out their website and their podcast. I actually listen to their podcast every week. It comes out on Tuesday, Devil's Bench Podcast. I'm really excited to go. I'm not excited for the seven hour drive, but doing road trips are fun. And then going to Canada, I've been to Canada like twice before, so that should be fun. I'm really looking forward to it. It should be really fun. Turning 31, that rhymed. You know it rhymed. It's a ominous looking day right now. TTH rule to thrule. Does that mean something? The two house rule or something. It's about 9.30, I'm finally gonna head home. I wanna show you this though, my students surprised me. During class, they stopped the music and were yelling for me and saying that something was wrong with the speakers. That happens all the time, so I was like, okay, I'll come help. And as soon as I got in there, these lovely balloons were there and they, they, they even knew what I liked. They got the Star Wars, yeah. It's Star Wars Rebels, I've only seen one episode of that, but hey, Star Wars is Star Wars. So huge thank you to my students, um, particularly Chris. I don't know if you were the mastermind behind it, but uh, if you're watching, thank you. They also got me cashews, macadamia nuts, grass-fed filet, and chicken legs. They're stuck at the bottom. Thank you very much. My birthday is already off to a great start. I'm gonna go home, and I probably should go to bed early and get all my stuff ready, but um, I'm gonna go play Halo and get some dinner. Good times are gonna be had. You got Brennan showing me how to cook a steak on a pan. Aw, cookie cookie now. Good and hot. Only need it on uh, each side a couple minutes each. It's nice and smoky in here. <laughs> okay, we're gonna do this little taste test. It smells good, it looks pretty good. It's pretty rare, but rare is good. Taste. Oh, it's pretty good. You're not hungry? I just had a whole pizza. <laughs> <laughs>
I'm laughing because you said that like I knew. <laughs> Happy birthday to me. <laughs> Halo 5, steak, best friend, sauerkraut. Come on, son. You didn't get better than this. Oh, man. <laughs> I don't know the best order of operations for what I'm doing right now. I need to sell eBay stuff, I need to back up for tomorrow, and I need to finish today's vlog. So I'm just gonna do it all right now instead of going to bed. Okay, check out this eBay haul. So when I was a kid, that would have been really exciting if those were Christmas presents. But now, I get the same feeling of joy and satisfaction from getting rid of stuff like that, which is fantastic. Anyways, it's now one in the morning. I have a seven hour drive tomorrow. I'm very excited, but I'm also not looking forward to this drive. I'm gonna hurry up and get to bed. Good night.